Picture this. Ethiopia, late 18th century, a Scottish explorer named James Bruce stumbles upon a collection of ancient texts. Welcome to the Curious Culture Club. Tucked away in an old monastery, a peculiar book catches Bruce's attention. It's called The Book of Enoch. Its pages are filled with angelic revelations, apocalyptic visions, and cosmic insights. A far cry from the conventional biblical narratives. Word gets out, and the theological world is set ablaze. The book is deemed too controversial, too radical, and efforts to suppress it begin. Scholars argue, debates rage, yet the Book of Enoch, with its enigmatic allure, refuses to fade into obscurity. Instead, it sparks off a quest for forbidden knowledge, a search for hidden truths that were perhaps deliberately left out of mainstream religious teachings. This discovery was just the beginning of the enigma that is the Book of Enoch. Before delving into the book, we must first understand its namesake, Enoch. According to biblical texts, Enoch was the great-grandfather of Noah, a figure of significant importance in the book of Genesis. He is noted for his extraordinary longevity, living for 365 years, a lifespan that intriguingly corresponds with the number of days in a year. Beyond his age, Enoch is a distinctive figure due to his unique departure from earth. Scriptures state that Enoch walked with God, and then he was no more because God took him away, an event often interpreted as an early ascension to heaven. This divine interaction sets him apart from other biblical figures, hinting at a special connection with the divine. This connection, some speculate, may have provided him with the revelations recorded in the book of Enoch. Enoch's life is shrouded in mystery, a fitting author for a forbidden book. The book of Enoch, a text so controversial it was excluded from the biblical canon. This enigmatic book, attributed to the great-grandfather of Noah, is brimming with revelations that diverge significantly from mainstream biblical narratives. It presents a world where angels descend to earth, mate with humans, and reveal secrets of the heavens. It's a world where Enoch, the scribe of righteousness, is taken on celestial journeys and shown the secrets of the cosmos. Yet within these revelations lie the seeds of controversy. The angelic interactions and the imparting of heavenly wisdom to humans were seen as heretical notions challenging the established religious order. The Book of Enoch seemed to blur the divine human boundary, a concept too radical for the orthodox faiths. Debates raged in theological circles. Was this text a genuine divine revelation or was it a dangerous deviation? The Council of Elders decided on the latter, and the Book of Enoch was excluded from the biblical canon. But was this a simple case of theological disagreement, or was there more to the story? Conspiracy theories abound. Some argue that the Book of Enoch was suppressed to conceal potent knowledge. Was this forbidden wisdom deemed too threatening to established religious narratives? Could the Book of Enoch hold keys to understanding truths that were intentionally omitted from mainstream teachings. The Book of Enoch, suppressed or simply misunderstood. As we delve deeper into this forbidden knowledge, we find more questions than answers. And perhaps that's exactly the allure of the Book of Enoch. The allure of forbidden knowledge is a powerful thing. It has the potential to unsettle our deepest beliefs to challenge our accepted truths and to push us toward uncharted intellectual territories. And the Book of Enoch is no different. It beckons those who are intrigued by the unconventional, those who dare to question the status quo. In the realm of traditional religious dogmas, the Book of Enoch is an anomaly. It dares to chronicle the celestial, the apocalyptic and the cosmological topics that were largely unexplored in the canonical texts. But what truly sets it apart is its unflinching exploration of the divine and the celestial. It is this audaciousness that makes the Book of Enoch a tantalizing enigma for those seeking unconventional spiritual insights. The Book of Enoch not only challenges established religious narratives, it also offers an alternative perspective 
a different lens through which to view the divine and the cosmos. It doesn't shy away from probing the celestial hierarchy, from delving into the mysteries of the universe and from exploring the nature of good and evil. This audacity, this defiance of established norms has resulted in its exclusion from the biblical canon. But it is also what continues to draw the curious and the open-minded. The allure of the Book of Enoch doesn't stop at its unconventional content. It is also believed by some to hold the key to unlocking hidden truths, truths that were intentionally kept from the mainstream religious teachings. This belief, although controversial, adds another layer of intrigue to the Book of Enoch. It hints at a deeper wisdom, a profound understanding of the universe that is yet to be fully uncovered. Whether a key to hidden truths or a product of its time, the Book of Enoch continues to challenge, fascinate, and provoke us to this day. It invites us to question, to explore, and to seek the truth, no matter how uncomfortable or unfamiliar. And it is this invitation, this call to intellectual bravery, that makes the Book of Enoch an enduring symbol of the allure of forbidden knowledge.